Keith Redmond was on his way home from work on Sunday morning when he was hit by a speeding car driven by a drunk driver who lost control of the vehicle. The accident occurred at Pojoint Public Road, West Bank de Marara. Residents said Redmond was hit off his bicycle and his body was flung several feet away from the point of impact and landed in a gutter. The car uprooted a small tree and destroyed a utility pole before slamming into a fence. Speaking to reporters, relatives of the now deceased Redmond say they want justice. The man stink of alcohol in the hospital. It's like the whole rum shop was on him there when we went there, when I was in there. The whole rum shop he smelled of. And where were you at? He had a hundred and um, six or something yeah. on the on the breathalyzer. It was a hundred and six or something or something like that. Foot was bent back so, and one was so, and he was in the gutter lying down. And they took the guy out, had him on the road for a while, took him over the road. I don't know why they talk about what they talk about over the road. And then they came and they took my uncle out, the ambulance came, and they took my uncle out and they took him to the best hospital. But the guy, they say he got a, sh a broken shoulder, and they carry him to the, in the, in the ambulance to Georgian Hospital to get him fixed up. Monica Redmond, niece of the dead man, is alleging that this was not the first time this driver has caused death while driving, and she's calling on the police to do a thorough investigation. We're trying to get some kind of justice because I heard this, this guy, man done this killed guy two killed three right or two persons right on the same right road. Right not far from me. On the same road, on two, two persons, separate, separate occasions. occasions. And this guy still have a license right to drive this place and drive this road. Right. If his license was evoked, he wouldn't be able to kill my uncle there like today. Or nobody else you wouldn't be able to kill. So why is this? Why this man kills so much people? I could ever pay you eh, to come drive on the road and give or kill somebody else. So this is a need more than justice. This need love. You know the name of the driver? No. The police in a release said their initial investigation revealed that after a breathalyzer test was carried out on the driver, he was found to be exceedingly above the legal alcohol limit. Redmond was 60 years old and lived at Bagusville, West Bank de Marara, with his wife and five children. He was attached to the West de Marara Regional Hospital as a security guard. 